everyone, what's up? It is me, Micah, and welcome to another home haul. Who do I call if it ain't you? Tell me who to call if If you guys are new to my channel, hello, welcome to my channel. You are very much loved and appreciated here. And for those of you who have been with me for a long time now, thank you, thank you for clicking on yet another video. Today, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys the different appliances that we just got, new additions to the Casa de Familia Oil. The idea behind getting these appliances is so that we can make our home smarter in order to cut down the time that we do our chores and to make our lives more convenient. It's not because we are lazy, but it's because Adrian and I have full-time jobs. The time that we usually use doing our chores, we can convert in order to keep working to generate income or to stop working and spend time with family or friends. And because your time matters, I'm gonna get right into the video. In order for you guys to get better information about the appliances that we got, I will first share with you guys some demonstrations and important specifications about the product and then after I will share my personal experience what I love and what I don't like about the product if any the appliances I will be sharing to you guys all came from the brand called Monarch they are a local brand they have a lot of amazing reviews online and I actually have friends who use appliances from Monarch and that's how we knew okay we can trust this brand. Starting with Monarch's cordless vacuum cleaner with the power drive mop called Charlie. Introducing Charlie, the latest cordless vacuum cleaner of Monarch with five different nozzle attachments, including the power mop. It has 25,000 PA suction power, which is incredibly powerful compared to your other regular wireless vacuums. It can also clean up to 45 minutes. Charlie has three different speed settings, low, medium, and high. In terms of how to use the product, First, we have different nozzle attachments, five to be exact. First one is the crevice nozzle, which is great for in between sofas, mattresses, and tight spaces. Second is the small brush roller, which I use on our mattress or our bed, and I also use it on our sofa. Third, we have the two-in-one interchangeable brush plus crevice nozzle. Fourth is the large brush roller. So this one has lead lights in order to help identify dust particles. This feature is incredibly helpful, especially for low lit areas in our house. It can also clean out different sized particles like food, crumbs, hair, and dust. But we actually don't use this on the floor. We only mainly use this on our rugs. I'm sure a lot of you have questions about this last nozzle attachment, which is the power mop, and it actually has a tank. This is perfect for polishing floors, especially on tiles or wooden floors. It also has microfiber attachments, and just an FYI, this will dampen the floor, but it will not make it too wet, which is such a great feature of this power mop. Super to general cleaning. Lastly, and the best thing is that it can vacuum and mop at the same time. How cool is that? Some care tips for the Charlie. Clear out dust container weekly. As you can see, our dust container is pretty dirty. So if yours is super dirty, it can be lightly washed, but it has to be completely dry before reattaching to the unit. To clean out the brush roller, use a small brush to brush away the particles that have attached. And for storage, you can mount the Charlie to keep it from falling or barricading walkways in your living spaces. And yes, the whole package comes with your mount. Okay, let's talk about my experience. The moment we unboxed this, we were so excited. In fact, out of the three that came here in our house, yun yung pinakauna namin binuksan. Adrian was particularly very excited about this because he loves everything technology. So you can definitely understand why this got him going dahil na sobrang dami niyang functions. It's a vacuum. It's a mop. It can vacuum and mop at once. <laughs> Hindi kami nahirapan at all even with set it up and attaching all the different attachments that it came with. In fact, dahil dito sa manual, keep the manual guys, super important and all the details you need to know 
are in here. Going back, dahil dito sa manual, hindi kami nahirapan. It was very convenient indeed because number one, it is cordless. So yung mga parts ng bahay namin na hindi namin nare-reach with the vacuum that has a cord, ngayon, we can just easily go to. Actually, there's a part in our bedroom, my side of the bed, that's so difficult to reach kasi walang malapit na saksakan doon. So every time I use the vacuum with a cord, hindi ko talaga siya na dadaan. Anan. So now, because the attachments are also so thin and there is this crevice attachment, it makes my life so much easier to reach through the parts that I used to completely neglect because, well, I just couldn't find a way to reach them. And not to mention, it is so powerful. I'm always at level one. I've never felt the need to go to level two or three because sobrang lakas na nila. And lastly, the sound. Yung pinaka ayoko talaga sa powerful vacuums ay sobrang ingay nila. In our old house, my mom had this huge heavy duty vacuum. And every time they would turn it on, it's like you have to drop everything kasi sobrang ingay niya talaga. But with the Charlie, sinay by side namin siya ni Adrian, tapos pinakinggan namin yung sound ng existing vacuum namin. Sobrang iba. Ang suwabe ng tunog ni Charlie. Ang social niyang pakinggan, basically. Even at the highest power option, it does not sound too bothersome for some reason. So that's it for my experience and as well as the things that I love about the vacuum Charlie from Monarch. What about the disadvantages? I'm sure you guys want to ask about that as well. I honestly don't see any disadvantage. I don't see anything that I don't like about it except for one thing. It's not something that I don't like, but I would say that it could be bothersome to some of you. The vacuum is a little bit hefty. Personally, for me, hindi ko naman siya sobrang napansin, but it was Adrian who pointed it out. So when I started using it, I was like, oh, nga, medyo mabigat nga siya. But if I'm being completely frank, that's only because you're buying a tool that is made out of quality components. To me, anything that is super light but looks good will feel cheap. So again, that could be a minus for you, but to me, it's more of a plus. I don't feel that it is too bothersome. Next up, we have this super cute RoboVac from Monarch called BotBot. Introducing Monarch's BotBot. BotBot is a robot vacuum cleaner that doubles as a mop. It has a slim design for tight spaces like underneath furniture. It has bumper sensors for navigation. Great for navigating through furniture, people, pets, even a flight of stairs. Yes, BotBot is not going to kill itself. BotBot is also remote controlled and you can schedule its cleaning time. It can be set to clean on its own routinely throughout the week. It's super cute because it has a homing program where BotBot returns to its charging port on its own. BotBot's cleaning time is about 90 to 100 minutes. You can also control the direction in which you want BotBot to go through the remote. And again, by switching the dust tank to the water tank, BotBot easily doubles as a mop, great for polishing floors. Lastly, just look at BotBot returning to his charging port. Super adorable. In terms of how to care for the product, you can clear out the dust container weekly. Again, if it's super dirty, wash it, but make sure it's dry before you attach it to the unit. If you use BotBot as a mop, make sure to wash the microfiber mop weekly and dry before reattaching to the unit. Guys, I can't get over the name BotBot. I just, I love it. It's so cute. It's so Pinoy. Si BotBot, anak namin yan, ni Adrian. As in, every time gumagalaw siya dito sa bahay, it's like we have to stop and drop everything and just watch him. We love our child bot bot. In terms of booting up bot bot, hindi siya mahilap talaga. Dahil nga meron kaming manual na binasa namin para alam namin how to navigate or how to use the RoboVac. Mandali lang namin siyang sinet up. It was super exciting for us to unbox it because it's the first time we have ever ever seen a RoboVac in action. And bot bot is smart. Actually, it doesn't bump into the furniture. It touches the furniture and then it just turns the other way. Once it knows, it won't be able to get through. What I like about BotBot, well, two in one shot, this RoboVac is also a RoboMop. Another thing, I thought our house was so clean the first time we used BotBot, but he, he, he went around for like 10 minutes and then he came back with so much dust and hair inside of his little bin. So BotBot cleans the parts 
na hindi mo alam madumi pala. And like what I mentioned, BotBot is very smart. I like the fact that kapag marapit na maubos yung battery niya, uuwi na lang siya mag-isa. Or meron nga siyang remote, so pwede mo rin siyang pauwiin kapag feeling mo, job well done na siya. There are also three different cleaning features. Just choose whatever is most convenient for you. So hindi lang siya naka-auto clean all the time. It can spot clean and it can also clean the edges of your homes. And of course, time-wise, ako si Miss Vacuum talaga eh. Although Charlie is already very handy, I think having BotBot is an extra layer of handiness. Because every day, instead of ako yung umiikot sa bahay, naghahanap ng mga areas na dapat kong linisin, pwedeng si BotBot na yung gumawa nun habang ako spending time with Adrian or I'm working. Pero ano ba yung sa tingin naming needs improvement sa aming anak na si BotBot? <laughs> Guys, alam nyo makarpet ako. So, hindi ko nagagamit yung mop feature niya. That's one thing for me. But then, that is my choice after all. And second and last thing that I feel like BotBot needs improvement on is kalaban niya ang mga extension. Eh, medyo marami kaming extension dito sa bahay. So, nasustock si BotBot sa mga extension. Guys, make sure na kapag maraming extension sa bahay nyo, ayusin yung muna siya before you let BotBot go through. That's really it for me. BotBot has been an amazing helper to me all in all. Next and lastly, ito yung sobrang unusual na hindi mo nakikita sa Pilipinas. Napapanood mo lang siya sa movies. But you know, it's time to innovate. We have Monarch's Tabletop Dishwasher. Introducing the modern tabletop dishwasher with a great compact size of 17.3 by 17 by 16.2 inches. It can load dishes for a family of four to five per cycle. And the best part is that it doesn't just wash, but it also dries dishes and cutleries. It also has easy installation options. First is the bucket or pail method, which is what we do. All you have to do is fill a container with water and use that as water source for the dishwasher. Second is the geyser method where you attach the hose to the spout of the faucet. This tabletop dishwasher is best to put beside the sink for drainage. Monarch's tabletop dishwasher has five wash programs. First is the eco mode, great for dishes with part dried food remnants like sauce or crumbs. Second, the normal mode, for moderate food remnants. Third, intensive mode for burned in food remnants. Fourth, the rapid mode, lightly oiled food remnants. This is actually their fastest program. It also has the glass mode, which helps regulate temperature for safety of dishes made of plastic or glass. And lastly, the safe keep mode, drying and sterilizing the dishes to keep them clean and odor free. Oh, and it also comes with Monarch's one kilogram dishwasher detergent. This is good for 50 loads, it's fragrance free, and it requires only two to three tablespoons per load. My experience! First time seeing this, I was so amazed, you guys. I mean, I've never seen a dishwasher here in the Philippines. Dishwashing is very tedious and it takes a lot of time, especially if you are going to be very detailed about that chore. So this, apart from adding some aliyo factor to us, minsan na nun, pinapanood lang namin siya. It has also chopped Adrian's time washing dishes, I think by about 45 minutes. And he's been able to use that to relax after a long day at work, which is what I want for him. Hindi ako naiiyak, guys. I don't know bakit parang nag-break yung voice ko. In all honesty, medyo nangain siya nung first time namin siyang trinay i-set up. But that's because we didn't have the right space for it. Sobrang pinilit namin siya dun sa area. Kaya kami sobrang nahirapan with the wires, the plugs. Pero nung nahanap namin yung perfect spot, it was so easy to do already. So that's a tip I have for you guys. Itama nyo yung discarte nyo. Ilagay nyo siya sa tamang place na makakagalaw ng maayos yung mga pipes and also the wire that it comes with. All in all, again, because of the manual, we did not have a hard time getting to know the dishwasher and at the same time setting it up. What I love about this is that again, it has saved us a lot of time from doing the dishes. Second, it has a lot of functions depending on what kind of cleaning your plates or your other cutleries need. As I've mentioned, there are five different functions. Just choose whatever is best for you. And lastly, it's very user-friendly. It's very straight to the point actually because all the buttons that you need and there are not a lot of them are right in front of you just under the little window where you can see the dishwashing happening inside oh and lastly i'm not sure did i say the last one was the last 
No, this is the last one. What we love about this is sobrang tipid niya sa tubig. Like, let's say for a family of four, 15 gallons usually yung ginagamit. Magiging three gallons na lang siya. That's for a family of four. What more kaming dalawa? You don't notice how much water you use kapag naghuhugas kayo ng manual. This one, isang balde lang siya. We are good to go. Things I don't like about the tabletop dishwasher. One, we don't live in a country where dishwashers are rampant. So the first con is really the lack of the resources in order to uh, utilize the dishwasher. Pero kami naman ni Adrian, nakahanap naman kami sa True Value and as well as sa Rustan Supermarket, I believe. But you can also contact Monarch in case you need to know where else you can get the dishwashing salt and the dishwashing soap as well. Second is dahil onti lang yung supply ng resources, mas mahal din siya talaga. It could cost you a little bit more, but personally for us, it's worth worth it because time is not something you can buy or pay for. So here, what you're paying for is convenience. Talaga. I really wanted to show you guys my experience and as well as the things that I love and things that I feel like are worth thinking about before purchasing these appliances. To us, love namin sila talaga. I mean, all of them, what we love definitely outweighs what we feel like can be improved. These have not only made our lives more convenient, but they've given us more time to do more important things like what we mentioned in the beginning. So you're not only buying these items to have new stuff around your home, but more so in buying these, you're investing your money in things that money cannot buy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and be part of the hashtag MyLovesFamily. I'm leaving you guys with love, hope, and faith. For today, you watched me, Michael Luis, and I cannot wait to see you again. Bye everyone!